All right, today we're going to talk about the cocktail Kushakushama Jam Kit. It's a great Christmas present. Hi, my name is Camelia Akami Keys, and today we are going to demo and unbox the Tama Cocktail Jam drum set. Super excited about this drum set. I recently beca became a Tama artist, and this was one of the drum sets I selected. And yeah, so we're gonna dive right into it. I'm gonna open up the box and go through everything that this drum set comes with. So, as soon as I open the box, here is what looks to be like a case. So, um, just from doing some quick video reviews myself and watching some stuff, I learned that it comes with like a hardware bag. There's quite a bit of hardware that comes with this, um, this drum set. Uh, so there's a lot of hardware to open up and go through. The legs of the bass drum are a little bit different than a normal traditional drum set. There's like three arms that hold up the uh, floor tom, which is connected to the kick drum. So here you see me grabbing and going through and unwrapping a lot of the different hardware. Um, this drum set was actually a bit challenging for me to put together because I've never played a cocktail kit before. But um, once I got it all set up, it's really cool and I think it's a great drum set for uh, a newer drummer or, you know, a smaller kid who might not be able to play or reach the kick drum pedal for a more traditional style drum set. So here I am going through, unwrapping and pushing the paper and stuff aside. Like I mentioned, there are a lot of pieces to this drum set. So a lot of hardware. So I'm just gonna continue to go through and unwrap and yeah. So, I was really happy when I opened this box and I saw a kick drum pedal. So what's really unique about this kit is how the bass drum pedal hits the bass drum. So the pedal is going to hit it in an upward motion instead of like a vertical and a traditional style. So um, I was happy that a uh, kick pedal came with it. So here I am. Here, you see me pulling out the case. So all the drums are in this case. So um, I really like the way they packed it. It was really, really easy to, to carry. It is a bit on the heavier side because of all the, the hardware, but it's you can carry this entire drum set like in one piece. Everything is connected. The snare, the kick drum, the four tom. And so uh, I really like that about it. But so, um, here is the uh, mounted tom, and uh, as you notice, there are no bottom heads. So you gotta be really particular about the tuning and make sure it's uh, you know sounding good. So that is the, the floor tom. So there's the floor tom and the kick drum, which basically look about the same, and they're the same size. Um, so yeah, there there's this like a uh, muffle pad that you put on top of the, the bass drum, and it actually helps um, make it sound a little more like a bass drum, so I like it. And then the pads that wrap around the drums are super cool, so when you're doing uh, a gig and you want to transport the kit, you have a nice way to get it all in one bag and, and just carry it like that. So, yep, so once I kind of went through the hardware, the, the drums were all together in this one case which I just thought was super, super cool. Really, really nice, compact drum set. And uh, I'm a really big fan of the, the small drum sets. So this was really something that caught my eye uh, when I became a Tama artist. And I was like, definitely want to get that drum set. So here is what it looks like. All taken apart. 
And there's the mounted tom, the snare, the floor tom, and the kick drum. So the coated head is on the kick drum, and then the clear head is for the, um, the tom. So yeah, check out that kick drum pedal. You gotta make sure you adjust it well, or it will not work. Mini Tom, Snare, all there, and I'm literally carrying all of it. So this is the this is the kit. It's all set up. It's the cocktail Tama Jam Kit, and I'm gonna go around back and give you guys a different view, so you see what it looks like to play it from this angle. Here is the kick drum pedal, and I'm just uh, still working on adjusting it. Um, you have to get it so everything has to be tight, and when it hits that bottom head, you want to make sure it's not hitting the metal. You want to make sure it's connected well, so there's not much um, wiggle room like on a normal, uh, a traditional drum set. You got to make sure that that kick drum pedal is really, really adjusted well, or it's not going to work very well so i love this pad that they have on top of the um the kick drum it really creates a, a nice sound for it and yeah overall it's an awesome kit if you're thinking about getting it i would say get it it's super cool i love it i love tama the quality is out of this world and i am just super grateful to be a part of the tama family that's just super awesome if you're wondering what the song is in the background it's called gratitude shake i wrote it it's on my um, album i choose love which was released in november of 2020 november 2020 on thanksgiving eve <laughs> 